<laughs> Back again, round two. Round round three. Yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna keep going. I'm just gonna skip out on that. I'm just gonna leave it all on. You can stay over here, bro. There we go. No, I'm just I'm coming up top. Coming up top. Let's see. Okay. That's one. All right. So Rick and I were messing around, and we realized this really isn't too hard. Well, I guess I realized this isn't too hard, and then we also realized a few things about our comments earlier in the video. So I'm just gonna continue on the video instead of ending it. Ending it for one, two. Uh, we're gonna go about installing everything in this video uh, just because like I said it shouldn't be too hard um, So this top piece here is for the you need the o-ring. Oh, do I need the o-ring? Yeah, yeah, grab the Okay, so this is for uh, the big one or the little one? Uh, Does it... The little one. The one that fits over that and So there's this one and then there's this one. What do you, what do yeah, you that think one. it's this little yeah, guy? That one. Um, so this top guy here Bitch, why'd you stop recording? Stop saying that. It'll actually oh. stop. Um, but as I was saying, <laughs> <laughs> this. Oh. So I just put this O-ring on it. Yeah. 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 Uh, go all the way up to the top. So this this guy here. Uh, and don't don't yeah don't. He is for the uh, fuel pr pump, so it provides pressure to the fuel pump. Um, so that's why that little Brillo pad's in there. Um, Eric was saying that's to uh, like stop oil blowback from getting into the fuel uh pump essentially yeah yeah basically it's just um because you're using pressure all right uh so we just we screw that guy in that's simple enough bada boom bada bing bada boom bada bing and then this the fuel pump actually goes on top of the motor yeah <laughs> so i saw it it was sitting here on somebody's and picture I, yeah i believe it's those two bolts right there yeah. yeah. Okay, so those will be, I believe, a 10 millimeter. They are M6 by 16s. What? Uh, the mean here. Yeah. An 8 mil? Yeah, the 7 didn't fit. So, well, they're M, um, yeah, I'm just, they're metric. Yeah, six. I got, I got you. And then, uh, so it goes in this orientation right here. I don't have the right size available. Here we go. Bing bong. I got the hair all over me. If only I had my impact. It's in the house. And I don't want to go grab it. Okay, but you take those off. Simple enough. Does it matter what orientation? Yes. The line oh, fittings face away from this. Or from the so it's like that. Okay. Okay. And then you got that on with the O-ring. Sweet. Tighten it down. No, I just put it on for now. All right. The big O-ring is for the, uh, is an extra for this. Okay. I do, but yeah, it is. All right, so that's on. If only I had some 91, we could run this. <laughs> you might have to make a run to the gas station. I need a new, uh, oh, I get, they probably have. <clears throat> make sure this is tight. Don't want it to come off. All right. Now, what do we need? Uh, I guess we can do the simple parts. An air filter. Ah, okay. I see they, they replaced this. For some reason, with a different with what? elbow, there's a curved elbow. Did this come with one? Yeah, is that what that's for? Yes, sir. Uh, I didn't realize that you take that off with the curve down. Oh, I think I'm just in the No, no, no. Video. It's, uh. Where'd it go? Oh, there, there it is. is. Yeah. So you replace the one that's on here. And then you use the bigger O-ring supplied by the Predator accessory kit. Mm. Look at us out here, just disassembling a brand new motor. Hey. You better do some serious racing with this thing, dude. Yeah, we're gonna do some racing, that's for sure. Off-road use, of course. Uh, you can race me on my motorcycle. But 
I guess it really wouldn't be fair. If I had the 300, it might be a little bit more fair. Yeah. <laughs> Just no balls. <laughs> Dude, the 300 literally only makes, like, I think it's like 257, actually. Two, and the two, 400, or the the five the Rebel 500 actually only makes, like, 480 or 490 or some what? shit like that. CC. Oh. They're not yeah. actually, like, 500. No. Okay. So what? Do we need this adapter plate on here? Does it need to stay? Yeah. Okay, yes it does. All um, right. Which gasket is this, this one? It's just is falling out. This is for the exhaust. Yeah. The papers are for the air, the graphite ones or whatever they are for. Oh yeah, obviously it's for the exhaust. It fits the, exi the design. Which way do you go with this is the question. I They're both the so. same, it doesn't really matter. Never mind. I don't know anything I just said. Do we need this? Do these have lock washers on them or no? No, it did not. Okay. No lock washers. We have no Loctite either. But yeah, I was gonna say some blue Loctite would be suffice. It would suffice. be ideal, but we do we have no lock. It's a nine o'clock too, so everything would be. Clean. Yeah. Is that the right way? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It only yeah, because the flange is different for the carb. Why would you throw this away from me, bro? Gosh, dude, I'm sorry. We just two. Two fucking dads out here trying to work on a motor. Dude, I need a Ferrari. I'm sorry. <laughs> I need a Ferrari. I'm sorry. Girls don't like boys. They like cars and money. And boys like Ferraris. And money. So, I mean, I guess we're all the same at the end of the day. <laughs> what was that? Good Charlotte? Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, Jamie used to talk so much shit about like this one. <laughs> Wait, what? Jamie used to talk so much shit about that. <laughs> Good Charlotte stuff. Oh, where's this one, too? That's for the uh, exhaust. It's going to be your uh, M8 nuts. Okay, okay, okay. One more Mate. Did. did those have? Oh, they did have lock washers. All right, grab your uh, grab your carburetor and your big old Yeah, yeah, yeah. One minute, one minute, bro. Okay, bud. You got to get that off still. Yeah, I know. Trust me. Trust. Trust. Oh, this doesn't fit. Son of a gun. Oh my god. Are they just, What? Bruh. They're just out here. They can't make anything the same fucking size. Oh, do we need a, another gasket for that? No, or, oh, that's the O-ring. O -ring. Never mind. O-ring and then an air filter clamp and then... Yeah, I got the air filter and the air filter. We need to show the people what's going on here. We good? I'm not going to knock anything off the table. No, this is... I like having this little bench right here. It's the perfect little workbench for out here. And my Rebel will fit right here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. You don't oh. understand. I want to be the the mini motor man. I'm going to have a... I guess you could keep that one in there. It's not, It's brand new. Or just use this one because it's what's supplied. And we'll put this one in a box and you can use it as an extra. Yeah, put it back in the bag. Ugh. Okay. Bada boom. Bada bing. Right, you know what we're gonna do? Oh, it doesn't fit. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. We'll go from the back side. Oh, wait, I'm stupid. It's, it's threaded. It threads into it. I'm hey, oh, that's upside down. That's upside down. Daddy, go flip it. There we go. I'm gonna be a mini motor god. <laughs> Bro, why does it seem so sketchy? It, like, doesn't line up. <laughs> I don't know. But it does line up. It does, but it doesn't. You know, it's kind of sketchy. Here, oh, no, it does not line up. <laughs> what? Did you put it down upside down? Bro, I don't know. I, think, I don't think so. I think so. Oh, maybe I did. Hey, oh, I see. Oh, Jacob, I see what we did wrong. It's supposed, we... to, go, it's supposed to go this way. I did. We... I, I did it wrong. Excuse me. <laughs> I did it wrong. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll, mi I'll fix the mistake. This was my mistake. I'll fix it. Oh, I'm stupid. Uh, oh, man. Done. I need a dab. <laughs> nice and snug. Now that we're on the right way. There we go. That's much better. God damn it. I'm getting me all confused. That's why I ha it's still upside down. Oh. That was on you. That was That one was on you. We're hot rodding right now. <laughs> this is gonna be lit, dude. We're hot rodding. 
I'm excited, actually. Yeah, this is Yo, this is little. the wrong size. Where's the... Uh, the smaller boy. Is it like a 5, 16? Dude, look at this fucking Tomei. Oh, this is the 8mm. Why was the 8mm on the other side? That's the... That's wrong. It's got the Tomei, dude. Just kidding. Anyway, this has got that fucking eBay. With the silencer. eBay headers. eBay headers, baby. That's that Skunk 2 knockoff. <laughs> Dude, I remember, do you remember my green, my green Civic with yeah. the skunks and yeah. the, uh, it had the, uh... That was my favorite Civic. It had, had the fart can, yeah, that was a beautiful, that would have been a beautiful track car. Yeah, honestly, it was pretty clean. I want to build one. I remember, I remember driving down F15, seeing it smashed on the tow truck at the gas station where they picked it up to take it. I really want to build another one. Too bad they, Stop like... Stop everything in here. Too bad they, like, doubled in price. You're not wrong. Uh, well, everything doubled in price. So. Where are these little gaskets? For? Competition use only. They're really making the competition use only. That's what I'm saying, bro. The They're trying thing. to like make a standard that is like race cart. Yeah, well, I mean, I don't think it goes this way. <laughs> Definitely goes that way. Eek. We'll get to that when we get to that, though. We gotta finish the cup. Getting ahead of myself. You can start. Go ahead. I don't care. Hmm. We're all doing something. Zipperoo, buckaroo. Bruh. Oh, you gotta this put the worm. You gotta put the worm up here. Oh, it's too tight. That doesn't do anything at all. <laughs> okay, she's on. Predator 212. Competition use only. Yo, what the fuck is this metal for? What? What is this metal for? Oops. Oh, that's the end. That's where they crimp it together because it's yeah. just. Even KNNs and stuff have that. Looks ugly. I should have flipped it. It's, it's fine. Don't worry about it. I'm worried about it. Stop. All right. All right, now we got this exhaust flange. Correct. She goes here. Throw her on. Throw her on. We'll put the two lock washes on first. Oh, you, oh, you, just, you just touched me in my no-no square right there. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we said it was an accident. Who? Um, Who? What are we talking? Uh, what are we talking? Oh, oh wait, where does this bracket? We got a bracket. That's. Does it go down here? Does it go down? No, no, it's nothing. I don't know. Where we'll end up, nobody knows. I like how they just include a head gasket. They're like, you might blow this up. It might be a Ford Focus RS. You might need this. <laughs> or a, uh, what else blows head gaskets? 6 0 power stroke. Where does this go to? Uh, Holy crap. I don't know, man. We'll get. We'll do one thing at a time. Okay. I'm, dude. Do one thing at a time. We got instruction manual. I don't know right. What's next? I'm sorry. Yeah, then, then, then. Competition use only. We about to smack on this. We about to compete. The only thing I'm concerned about is this clearing the rear rail on the go kart. Yeah. We might be doing some notching. We might. I might break out the welder. We might have to break I out. I hope we don't have to break out no welds. I don't want to adjust the manco at all. The manco, yeah, I wouldn't. We could just put it on the mini bike. Go rip. It's real fast. This would probably fit good on the mini bike, honestly. Yeah, but like I feel like it'd be more fun on the go kart, to be honest. Yeah. We'll hot rod it up. <clears throat> All right, so we are back. Um, the only thing we have not done is this support beam for the exhaust, which I honestly, I don't think we need it. I think it'll be kind of lame. I think it looks good like it's this. It's pretty solid. I don't know. I'm kind of sad that it has competitive use only. But, I mean, I get why they're going for it. Um, got an extra... This is pretty crusty. I don't know if I should keep that. The exhaust piece. I'm gonna keep, I'll keep it. Get back yeah, with. why not? Just keep all the spare parts. You never know. I'm a spare part machine. No, well, I mean, you have an extra head. Yeah. So. yeah. Um, so I don't know if this head gasket is like necessary, necessary. 
realistically. The black tube is an oil breather tube. Carburetor drain hose. Yeah, so that... Yeah, I don't know where it goes on here though. Um, it says it's on the side. Oh, you're knocking wrenches. Is it the one that goes on the other? No, that's the drain. The carburetor drain. Right. I just saw it. Oh, oh this goes in the OHV, I believe, right? Is that what this is Does for? Does it? Oh, yeah. Two guys, one ghost. <laughs> that's a good name. <laughs> and loaded Sick. and that's everything installed at this rate that we can do um once i get a fuel tank uh i don't even know maybe lakes will have a fuel tank i'll have to go look online they might have them the place nearby um could also probably get away with just using like a um like a lawnmower fuel tank you think you go to like ace yeah you, you can use any fuel tank menards well yeah yeah no i feel you i'm just trying to think about like like size wise, yeah. I don't know what like a good quality is either. Like, do I get like a? I'm trying to get like a metal tank probably. Or go plastic. Nothing wrong. Cheaper. Maybe. I feel like the metal might be a safer option though, based off the location, because we're gonna have to like route it. We don't want to set it on top. Yeah. It's not like a. Well, I guess we need to size it up too and hopefully see if it fits the go kart. But we'll do that in another video. I'm gonna definitely do it after this video, but <laughs> I'll definitely do it in the other video because I don't feel like continuing on. So hopefully you all enjoyed. If you did, leave us a like, share, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, I'll try to have a more um, standardized schedule again with the mini motors uh we're gonna have a motorcycle sh shortly so i don't really know what the plan is obviously that in theory is technically a mini motor it's only 500 cc um i mean it is a motorcycle but motorcycles are small engines in my opinion comparatively you know yeah so yeah Beast. Except for leader bikes. Leader bikes are pretty... I mean, you're getting up into sizable territory there. What are you talking about? Leader bikes. 1,000cc. Oh, uh, well, yeah, that's different. I uh, 100% agree with that statement. Like street bikes. I agree with that statement. That's different. But, like, I mean... They're still, like, mini motors in a way. Because, like, I don't know. I guess not. The, the fucking, no, I feel... Some of the Harleys are fucking kind of big-ass engines. Dude, yeah, I mean... Gotta crank the hog, Barb. Watch out for the grass glibbins. How tight should I make? I think that's good. Tight like a tiger. I mean, I don't want to break it, though. You won't. That's a hardened stud. Okay, that should be good. That's pretty tight. Yeah, this stuff's pretty tight. Every, everything's tight. on fine. That's good. I don't... 